things that media has done for me was it brought all those amazing things. But uh, the other thing that brought was um, negative opinions. Mm. So you see, I'm dark. If you but, see but my I'm brother, you. <laughs> you're a man, doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. See, my brother yeah. is light. Okay. And he's a beautiful man. Mm. So growing up, I've always had been compared with my brother. Like, oh, this should have been the goal. You know, like people mean the, like it's, they say it in the most innocent of ways. Like, this should have been the goal. But it's hurtful. But it's hurtful to me because what are you saying about me? Because I am the goal. What are you saying? And then you get thrown into the media. And it doesn't help that when I started off, I was doing English card things. <laughs> so I was literally a boy. And I understood that. But it didn't help that most people found it the only thing that they wanted to comment on. Like, oh. Was your... Yes. Uh, so it's body shaming. It is body shaming. And I see it with a lot of women. And I get that people get a kick out of it. Uh, people... And sometimes, like, people don't have filters. And it's social media, you think it's on your phone. You don't know that on the other end is an Human actual being. person. What does it do to you? What has it done to you? It really did knock off. Um, so from an, an early age, before it was even through the phone, as I said, I've always been compared with Muku. Muku being the beautiful girl, the beautiful boy. boy. And I being the girl that was supposed to be the boy. Um, what it did is it made me not care so much about looks, which protected me at that time. I actually think if I was the beautiful Muku, probably I would have found a rich husband to marry me off at 13 or something. <laughs> so I think, it, I think it protected me. Oh. But um, as you get older and you become more of a woman, you start to care oh. about what people think. And people writing about those things, it really hurts. It does. Because I know it's you're probably somebody I'm never going to meet. But why do you feel the need to say that? How do you benefit? How do you benefit from it? And I've never really talked about it except in one um, Facebook post. But I see it happen with so many women. So you, you bring a very powerful guest. Per a person is talking about a powerful story, beautiful nuggets, everything that you can get out of. And all the person's gonna think about is comment about their outfit, comment about their looks.